Hey, what is up everybody? My name's Star Lords. I hope that you're all having a fantastic day. I know I am. There's a brand new update tomorrow and it's gonna add in a lot of new exciting things into the game such as squeaky little toys, uh, such as ducks, and also a brand new assault rifle coming to the game of Battle Royale. Uh, very interesting news and we're actually going to be talking about that in today's video as well as some more leaks that will be revealed tomorrow such as new skins, new items, all that kind of stuff all coming for us tomorrow, so it's very interesting. Uh, but anyway, before we do get into today's video, guys, please do not forget to leave a like if you do end up enjoying it. Also, subscribe to the channel if you haven't already for more Fortnite glitches, guides, videos, all that kind of stuff, including a couple of V-Bucks giveaways when I can actually afford them. Talking about V-Bucks giveaways, I've actually got one going on on the channel right now for 10,000 V-Bucks, so go into the description below, click on that top link if you haven't already, and it'll give you all of the information you need to know about entering that giveaway. Uh, but anyway, like I said, let's get into talking about this brand new news. Uh, so of course, a lot of people know now tomorrow that uh, a lot of new things are going to be happening. There's going to be a brand new challenge where you have to hunt little tiny ducks, and I'm going to have a video on that tomorrow. So we're going to see a lot of ducks around the map and everything like that. But also, it has been announced that there is going to be a brand new assault rifle coming to our game tomorrow in the form of a burst rifle. Yes. Now, these weapons have actually been leaked a long time ago. I don't know why everyone recently started going crazy about them, but basically, if you haven't already seen what they used to look like, they will be on screen right now, and as you can see, it is a weapon that is, um, it's actually called in real life the G36C assault rifle, which has a burst mode on it. Now, a long time ago, these were added to the in-game files of Fortnite Battle Royale, and everyone was going crazy about them, including myself, because I love that weapon, but, it was actually released that today we're going to see that weapon change into the one that we see on screen right now. And as you can see, that one on screen right now is, um, it's actually, uh, yeah, it's a FAMAS. If you don't know what that is, it's an actual real life weapon. It was very popular in the game uh, Call of Duty Modern Warfare 2. And uh, as you can see from the new update screen, it says here, Burst Assault Rifle coming soon. Burst through the competition with a new epic and legendary rarity assault rifle. Very, very cool indeed. Now, as I did say, you know, these this weapon right here has been in the game's file for a long time. I mean, Epic Games must have been in, like, private servers testing these out for a while because originally they did look like the weapons I showed you just a second ago. The very weird-looking G36 weapon. That is originally what the FAMAS was. But obviously, over the time of, you know, testing and everything like that, the developers have clearly said to themselves, like, listen, let's throw in a brand new weapon, something that we haven't had in Save the world before and let's add in the FAMAS assault rifle because that's a pretty cool weapon and it doesn't have two toggle modes. I believe the FAMAS only has one which is a burst assault rifle kind of uh, mode and uh, that's very interesting you know because none of us expected it. I mean a long time ago I did a top 10 video where I talked about top 10 weapons I would love added to this game and one of the top weapons that I wanted was an actual FAMAS assault rifle so that's actually pretty cool that they decided to add in this weapon into the game. I'm really really happy about that. Now what's really cool about this is that you know the leak was kind of true you know um, a long time ago that G36 weapon actually had values and statistics of how much damage it was caused, how much headshot damage it would cause, and I've actually got all of that in today's video. I'm going to be comparing all of the different assault rifles with each other in today's video, so that's going to be very interesting. Um, but like I said, a long time ago, that was leaked, and uh, it's actually kind of cool because there was a lot of other weapons that were leaked along with that one, such as the P90, which can actually show us that hopefully soon we may actually be getting a P90 added into Fortnite Battle Royale 2. Not only that, but there will most likely be a brand new no-scoping kind of, uh, I guess, sniper rifle, which can actually collateral people. Yes, that's right. Bullets can actually pass through them and hit other people, you know? So uh, I'm guessing that with this new update tomorrow, we're going to see a lot of brand new news and leaks in the actual in-game files of Fortnite Battle Royale. Now what's very interesting about this is that I actually know how to go into the in-game files and see a lot of information that not all of the users who play Fortnite can actually see. So guaranteed tomorrow, I will have around about two or three videos on my channel uh, discussing some of the brand new leaks. Hopefully we're going to hear a little bit more about the new weapons coming, a lot of new skins. I guarantee you will have skins on uh, skin leaks, weapon leaks, 
uh, I guess pickaxe leaks, gliders leaks. There's gonna be a lot of them, guys, and I'm gonna have them on my channel first thing in the morning. As soon as the update comes out, I'm gonna data mine it. I'm gonna check out all of the new goodies that we're gonna be getting in Fortnite Battle Royale. Uh, not only that, but we should hear a little bit more about some new game modes coming to the game, uh, and especially the jetpack. It's actually been getting updated little by little in the in-game files very secretly, but um, yeah, I'm thinking that the jetpack could actually be something that gets added in very, very soon. Like, I'm talking the next, like, four weeks soon, you know? So that's actually pretty interesting. Uh, but anyway, guys, tell me what you feel about this new weapon in the comment section below right now. Are you excited for it? Do you think that it's a bit unnecessary? I mean, personally for me, if I see a blue... Is a blue normal assault rifle and I see a gold one of this new one honestly I'm probably just gonna pick up the blue assault rifle because I have all of the different damage variables on screen right now and as you can see we're gonna compare these really quickly I'm actually gonna have a standalone video over on this in the next couple of days but as you can see we have the assault rifle bull br uh, wait, wait 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 what is that called a bull pup burst okay yeah so originally that was what it was called in the in-game files and of course as you can see that was what it used to look like but obviously now they've changed it but still I guess that these new damages that you see right here are still the same as the ones that we are going to see tomorrow so if we just kind of look at this right here so the assault rifle on the left hand side which is the brand new burst rifle the epic variant does 32 damage to the body 64 to the head with a reload time of 2.5 seconds. That's actually pretty pretty decent in my opinion Now we kind of uh, kind of I guess compare it with some of the other weapons here So uh, again if we compare it with the assault rifle m4, which is the blue uh, assault rifle at the bottom there As you can see it says here 33 to the body 66 to the head and it's got a reload time of 2.2 seconds, so that's very fast for reloading. And also, it does one more uh, damage to the body, and also two more damages to the head. So clearly, you know, the blue assault rifle is still better than the, uh, I guess, the epic uh, burst rifle, which is very confusing, but still, you know, whatever they, it's whatever they decide to do. Uh, but clearly, you guys can now see why I would pick the blue burst, or sorry, the blue normal assault rifle over that one itself. Now we compare these guys to the old uh, burst rifle. As you can see, um, I guess the legendary version of this does 33 to the body and 66 to the head, which is the exact same as the blue normal assault rifle. Uh, but if we compare it to the old burst, you can see that it does three times more damage. It does six times more damage to the head and also is uh, 2.3 seconds of reload speed, whereas the old burst rifle is 2.6 seconds. So obviously, you know, the clear indicator here is that if you see a purple or a, a gold, um, I guess it's a purple or a gold burst rifle on the floor or a blue burst rifle on the floor, the obvious thing here is to take the purple or the gold. You know, it's definitely much higher than the actual existing ones. Now, if you just compare this to the best weapon in the game, arguably is the uh, SCAR assault rifle. So the SCAR, uh, which is, an, uh, I guess, the legendary version, does a 36 to the body, 72 to the head, with a reload time of 2.1 seconds. We can just see here that it's no match. Honestly, the SCAR is still the best weapon in the game by far. I mean, genuinely, like nothing even compares. I mean, damn, I would have thought that the burst assault rifle would do a 35 to the body and maybe a 36 to the head or sorry, a 70 to the head, but clearly not. I mean, wow, I don't know. Maybe they'll balance them out later on throughout the week or something. Obviously, you know, if people don't like how much damage they're doing, the reload speed or whatever, uh, obviously they will take to Reddit and Epic will hear the fans feedback and then do a couple of changes here and there if they need to. Uh, but other than that, if there is no changes needed, then we're just gonna get a brand new assault rifle, which is pretty darn cool. Uh, but anyway guys, like I did say, there's gonna be a crazy amount of new leaks tomorrow, so please make sure that you subscribe to the channel to not miss out on that. Also, like I said, you know, there is a giveaway in the actual description below, so you know, there's nothing really much to it, just click on it, it'll ask you to subscribe to me, it'll ask you to give, uh, kind of, I guess, your YouTube username, so that I can contact you, and that's pretty much it. Uh, but anyway, tell me what you feel about this uh, this update tomorrow, guys. Are you excited for it? Are you not that bothered? Personally, I'm just excited about the ducks. I cannot wait to 
get my hands on a squeaky little dog. Um, other than that, guys, thank you very much for watching today's video. I do hope that you enjoyed it. If you did, don't forget to leave a like. And until next time, I've been Star Lord. Oh, see ya.